Hi knitters and crocheters and welcome to my channel. I'm Francesca and this is my first English video tutorial. So sorry if my English will be not perfect but I am Italian and I'll try to do my best. I want to satisfy the request of some of you who asked me to make English version of my video tutorials. So today we're going to knit this very simple shawl scarf with kid mohair yarn. The brand is Aish Yarns and you can find this product on my online shop. I leave you the link here below in the description of this video. The composition of this yarn is 30% acrylic, 30% kid mohair and 40% of polyamide. We will work with two thread together and we will use knitting needles number 6 mm or US 10. Here I'm working on a sample, but I'll give you all the correct measurements and the uh, correct number of stitches of my original project. So let's start and cast on 80 stitches. Now for the first, the second and the third row, we're simply going to knit all the stitches. So now for 24 rows, we have to repeat two rows. For the first row, knit all the stitches on your needle. Turn your work and for the row number two, knit four. Purl 72 stitches, and knit 4 again. So let's continue to repeat these two rows for a total of 24 rows. After these 24 rows, we're going to start with the cables. From this point, you have to repeat 10 rows for all the length of your scarf or shawl. And you can repeat these rows as long as you want your project. For the first row, knit 10. Slip 6 stitches on a cable needle. and put this needle in the front of your work. Now continue to knit for 6 stitches on your left needle. Take your cable needle and knit these 6 stitches. Now knit for 36 stitches. Take again your cable needle, slip 6 stitches. And continue to knit next 6 stitches on your left needle. Now knit your 6 stitches on your cable needle. For to finish this first row, knit the last 10 stitches. For 
For the row number two, turn your work and knit four stitches. Purl for 72 stitches. And to finish this second row, knit last four stitches. For the third row, knit all the stitches. For the fourth row, knit four. Purl seventy two and knit four again. In the row number five, we're going to create a braid in the center of our stall. So let's start knitting 34 stitches. Now slip 6 stitches on your cable needle and put it in the front. Continue to knit for 6 stitches, return to your cable needle and knit these 6 stitches. Let's continue to knit for the 34 stitches left. Row number six, turn your work and knit four. Purl 72 and knit the last four again. Row number seven, turn your work and knit all 80 stitches. Row number 8 again turn your work and knit 4 purl 72 and knit the last 4 again Row number 9, knit all the stitches. For the row number 10, that is the last row to repeat, knit 4, purl 72 and knit last 4 again. Here we are, that was the 10th row, that is the last row to repeat and from this moment you have to go ahead and repeat from row number 1 to row number 10 uh, as long as you want your scarf or your stole. So when you finish to repeat all your 10 rows for as long as you want your project, you have to repeat again only row number 1. After you repeat this row, we are ready to close our work. Knitting like when we began uh, for 24 rows in this way. Row number 1, we will knit 4 purl 72 and knit 4 again and row number 2 knit all the stitches. You have to repeat these two rows for 
24 total rows. After these 24 rows, we have to work the very last three rows to close. We're going to knit all the stitches for three rows. Now we have only to cast off our work and it is very simple. You have to knit the first stitch, knit the second stitch and pull the first stitch over the second stitch. And again knit one, pull the first over the second one and go ahead in this way to cast off all the stitches and close your work. And to finish you have only to pull the thread through the last loop. Excuse me please if I made some mistakes, but I tried to be as understandable as possible. So if you like English video tutorials and you like to have more, Please like, subscribe and comment this video. Thanks for watching. Bye.